Netflix's number one ranking, All of Us Are Dead, is a Korean zombie drama based on a very popular webtoon in 2009. As all shows with original comics are, there are several differences between drama and original comic. Do you think this Korean zombie Netflix show was hardcore? If you watched the original comic, you're going to feel like this show should be in Disney+. Plus. So let's see some differences between Netflix and original comic. And of course, spoilers ahead. Let's take a look at main characters. In the original comics, Taesu and Hyojung die at the very beginning, and Woojin and Cheongsan die earlier than the deaths in the show. And Nayeon, the girl from Squid Game who made everyone bawl their eyes out, turned into a little bitch. The whole time I was watching, whenever she opens her mouth, I was like, bitch, you do something. My mom is a middle school teacher, and even she said if she had a student like that, that bitch is going straight to the zombies. But compared to the original comic, Nayeon in the drama is an angel. In the Netflix show, Nayeon kills Kyungsu alone, but in the original comic, she kills so many more. After she kills Kyungsu by infecting him, she sees a vision of him because of a guilt. She tries to stab the vision, but stabs Woojin with a scissor instead, and that is how Woojin dies. Bitch! Unlike the drama, English teacher stays alive in the comic. Nayeon kills the teacher too, because she sees the vision again. In Netflix, there is a slight growth of her when she comes out of the storage. But in the comic, she is consistent. That bitch be like, it's not my fault! And she gets killed by Pinam. Yes! Finally! Let's talk about the love square. In the Netflix, Cheongsan likes Onjo, Onjo likes Suyok, Suyok likes Namla, Namla likes Suyok. In the original comic, there's no bullcrap nope. like that. It is all about the survival. Well, Cheongsan does like Onjo and sacrifices himself for her, saying that I'm the happiest one here today, motherfucker. Finally, we need to talk about Quinam, the antagonist of the show, the man who always falls down. Ah! 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 Yeah! In drama, he is a bully, obsessed of killing Cheongsan. But in the original comic, he's a straight up psychopath who enjoys this from the very beginning. Well, for starters, the biggest difference is that in Netflix, Queen Anne doesn't have an eye. In the comic, he has no dick. In middle school, he tried to rape a student, and she bite his sausage off like ARR! In the mayhem, he glues survivors' mouths so they cannot bite him. And after he becomes half zombie, he just kills everyone he sees and enjoys it. In Netflix, he just becomes strong and climbs to the roof. In the comic, he sees the teacher dead and pulls the little red riding hood. He puts on her dress, puts on her hair, and be like, Guys, this is a teacher! Pull me up! And he gets shot with an arrow and dies. Also, some characters in the Netflix show are not in original comics. Unji, yeah! the phone destroyer, the girl who gives a birth in the bathroom, and Onjo's fireman dad, the politician, they are not in the original comics. Personally, I think them not being on the show would have been better. They made the show slow and not really seem to have an impact on the plot. Next time, as original comic hardcore fan, I will do a spoiler review on the Netflix show. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you liked it, make sure to click that subscribe and like button. Thank you for watching, and bye bye. Screw. Screw. Grammar. <laughs> Screw grammar.